Hi everyone, Shai here. I hope all of you are doing good. Welcome to another new video. Across the world, there are countless species of bugs that present serious dangers to humans. While some announce their peril with bright colors, others, appearing innocuous, conceal lethal capabilities. Each carries its own unique risk, spanning from seemingly harmless ants to insects inhabiting the most unexpected environments. Here are a few dangerous insects that it's wise to steer clear of. Number 1. Black Widow Spider the black widow spider is one of the most well-known and feared spiders in the world. It is found throughout the world in many different habitats but is most commonly found in the warm, dry climates of the American Southwest and Mexico. The female of the species is the most dangerous as she is the one that possesses the venom-filled spinnerets. The venom is 15 times more potent than that of a rattlesnake and can cause a variety of symptoms in humans ranging from localized pain and swelling to more serious cases such as muscle spasms, sweating, and even paralysis. In rare cases, a bite from a black widow spider can be fatal. The female of the species is easily identified by its black body and distinctive bright red hourglass-shaped marking on its abdomen. The male of the species is usually much smaller and has no venom but is often mistaken for the female due to its similar coloration. Black widow spiders are usually found in large places such as under rocks, in crevices, and in wood piles. They also build large webs in which they can lay hundreds of eggs. A female will often stay with her eggs until they hatch and will aggressively defend them from any perceived threats. So you know, watch out for that red hourglass. Number 2. Deathstalker Scorpion With such an ominous name, surely you are not expecting a lovey-dovey cute little insect. The Deathstalker scorpion is one of the most dangerous and lethal creatures in the world found primarily in North Africa and the Middle East. This scorpion is one of the deadliest of its kind. It is a large yellow-brown scorpion with a body length of up to seven and a half inches. The Deathstalker scorpion's sting can certainly be fatal and if not, extraordinarily painful. These little terrors live in a wide variety of habitats from sandy deserts to rocky hillsides. It is nocturnal and spends most of its time hiding in dark, damp places during the day. At night, it emerges and hunts for food, which usually consists of insects, spiders, and small lizards. The Deathstalker scorpion sting is incredibly dangerous and can cause swelling, nausea, and even death if not treated quickly. Its venom contains a powerful neurotoxin that can cause paralysis and also respiratory failure. It can take several days to recover from a sting and even then, the effects may be long-lasting. The Deathstalker scorpion is an incredibly dangerous creature and one that should not be taken lightly. Its venom is incredibly powerful and can cause serious harm to humans if encountered. If you see one of these creatures in the wild, it is best to leave it alone and not risk coming into contact with it. Number 3. Blister Beetles Blister beetles are a species found in many parts of the world. They are known for their ability to produce a toxic compound called cantharidin, an irritant that causes painful blisters on the skin of humans and animals when they come into contact with the beetle. That's why they are called blister beetles. Even in low doses, cantharidin can be very dangerous and can cause severe pain and blistering of the skin. These pesky crawlies are commonly found in North and South America, Europe, Asia, and Africa, and they prefer to live in sunny, dry environments such as deserts and grasslands. They are also found in agricultural fields where they feed on crops such as alfalfa, corn, and potatoes, making them pests to farmers. In humans, contact with blister beetles can cause painful burns, itching, and blistering of the skin. In animals, ingestion of the beetle can cause severe irritation of the mouth and other areas of the body, as well as nausea and vomiting. In extreme and rare cases, cantharidin poisoning can cause death, given their potential to cause severe harm. It's important to be aware of the presence of blister beetles in your area and take steps to avoid contact with them. If you do come into contact with a beetle, it's important to wash the affected area with soap and water as soon as possible. Before moving on to the next point, I'd like to take a moment to introduce you all to my merchandise. You can support my content by getting your favorite products from my store or by simply joining my channel. Your support means a lot to me. Now, let's get back to the video. Number 4. Parasitic Worms Parasitic worms, also known as helminths, are small organisms that live in the bodies of other animals, often humans. They can cause a variety of illnesses and symptoms such as abdominal pain, diarrhea, weight loss, and malnutrition. In some cases, parasitic worms can even cause death. These horrific little bugs can be found in many places throughout the world 
but they are particularly common in tropical and subtropical regions. They are most often transmitted through contaminated food and water, but they can also be transmitted through contact with infected animals, soil, or other objects. The most common type of parasitic worm is the roundworm, which lives in the small intestine of its host. These can cause symptoms like abdominal pain, diarrhea, and weight loss. Other types of parasitic worms include tapeworms, hookworms, and whipworms, which can all cause similar symptoms. The most dangerous type of parasitic worm is the hookworm, which can be spread through contact with contaminated soil or objects. They can cause severe anemia, which can be fatal in some cases. If you are absolutely disgusted by this, here are a few steps you can implement to minimize your exposure to helmets. Washing your hands regularly and ensuring your food is properly cooked and stored can go a long way. Number 5. Eel Moth Caterpillars The eel moth caterpillar is a small, colorful insect with a dangerous sting. It is found throughout the United States, especially in the southeast and midwest regions. The eel moth caterpillar has a unique and striking appearance with a bright green body with white and red stripes. It also has spines that are hollow and can easily break off, embedding deeply into the skin. The caterpillar lives in trees, shrubs, and low-lying vegetation where it feeds on a variety of plants. When it's time to pupate, the eel moth caterpillar will spin a cocoon in the leaf litter or attach itself to a tree or shrub. This caterpillar is a dangerous insect to humans as its venomized spines can cause a painful sting. The sting is usually mild and localized, but it can cause more severe reactions in some people, including swelling, itching, and even anaphylactic shock. It is important to take precautions when handling eel moth caterpillars, such as wearing gloves and long sleeves to avoid contact with it altogether. Despite its dangerous nature, the eel moth caterpillar is an important part of the natural ecosystem, playing a vital role in the food chain by providing food for birds and other animals. Number 6. Velvet Ants Velvet ants are small insects that are more common in the southwestern US, although they can also be found throughout the southeast. They are often mistaken for ants because of their similar size and shape, but they are actually a type of wasp. They are known as cow killers or cow ants due to their painful sting, which is said to be strong enough to kill a cow. However, this is not really true. Velvet ants can be found in grassy areas and around the edges of forests. They are usually seen during the day wandering around in search of food. They feed on nectar and other insects and can be found in meadows, gardens, and even in homes. Although the nickname cow killer is undeserving, they are nevertheless extremely dangerous to humans. Their sting can be excruciatingly painful and may result in swelling, nausea, difficulty breathing, and even anaphylactic shock. They are called velvet ants because both males and females are covered by dense velvety hair with brilliant patterns of black with red, yellow, or orange. The females always lack wings and are most often seen scurrying around the ground, while the winged males are not usually noticed. As you can see, dangerous bugs come in many different shapes and sizes and can be dangerous in many ways. But what about you? Have you ever encountered one of the deadly bugs mentioned in this video? Tell us all about it. So, that was all for today. I hope you have watched the video up to this time stamp. Make sure to press the like button if it amazed you. Press the subscribe button if you still haven't subscribed to the channel, as it's totally free. You can follow me on all social media platforms. All links are given in the description. You can also watch other cool stuff. The playlist link is also mentioned in the description. I will catch you up soon in the next video. Till then, peace out.